we do know that Black and Hispanic patients do have more out-of-hospital cardiac arrest, but Black, Hispanics, and women are the least likely to receive bystander CPR. Today's goal was really to address this important issue, to close the gap. We have very little control over if what happens between the time when somebody's discovered to be in cardiac arrest and the time we get there. And that's a crucial period of time because when their heart's stopped, their brain's not getting oxygen. I took training myself this morning. I feel empowered. I feel ready to go. And hopefully I won't need to use it. But if I do, I feel like I can help. I have the confidence to help someone in need. It's been awesome because you never know when you're going to need something like this. This is about educating community members, our own members as well on the importance of CPR training. We, any one of us can find ourselves in a place where somebody needs help. Knowing what to do is that difference between having a catastrophic event versus saving a life. I never want to be in that position where I feel helpless. So to come out and, and do this was big for me. I know a lot of people really want to help, but they're scared because for one, they think that they need to be certified. So the goal was to show and to remind that you don't need a certification. This was a critical reminder that we all can do our part to help our loved ones.